guys, Ron Guruji here and today I am going to be talking about the OnePlus 6T. Well, I know it's a pretty old phone, but it recently received a very stable Android 11 room. But before we get into that, if you're new here, press that subscribe button and the bell icon for all the notifications and let's get started. Talking about the OnePlus 60, when it was launched, it became an instant hit. It won an MKBHD's Phone of the Year award and a lot many more awards. It was a fantastic phone, great quality hardware, trustworthy hardware and game-changing technology, right? So when it launched, it was top of its kind, top of its class. But then again, the hardware has become a bit dated. Yet, the community seems to be constantly developing uh, ROMs for OnePlus 60 and in spirit of that, it has received an Android 11 pretty much stable custom ROM called POSP. So I decided to give it a try since I was pretty bored with my IQ UI. IQ, please take notes if you're watching this. So POSP ROM is one of the most stable Android 11 ROMs I've seen out there and I've seen OEMs release betas for their phones and they're not as stable. Right? So the POSP ROM is really stable, everything works, all right? the UI seems to be smooth and snappy, everything seems to be in place. The media controls, new media controls in Android 11 seem to exist there and if you see that in the quick settings the media controls exist and they work pretty well, you can change the volume, you can change the device they're outputting to from there, so that's really nice. The notifications are now organized very well. So you get the conversation tabs, the silent notifications, etc. So all the notifications are tabbed and that is visible in this uh, room and is working really well. Even the notification bubbles are working well. But it's I think a problem with Google uh, implementation that these bubbles can't be, you know, opened on your own. They only open up like the option to open them as bubbles only comes up when there's a new notification. So that is something I think is a problem of Google's implementation itself and would change soon. The always on display on this phone does not work. So right now the always on display isn't working. It might work in the future. There are not a lot of customization options also available on this room right now. But that is given since this is a really new OS and it's pretty stable given that. Right, the animations again are very smooth and snappy. There's no stutter or lag on this phone. I was actually surprised coming from a 2020 phone. I still felt that this phone was feeling much more smoother. So I really like that. That's a really nice thing to see in a phone, right? That's pretty old. Also, the gaming works really well. Albeit that now the hardware is a bit dated. So yeah, you won't get the same 2020 gaming experience as far as the graphic quality goes. But the experience is smooth and snappy. You feel no laggy or stuttery frames in um, Call of Duty. I have played Call of Duty Mobile on it and it works perfectly fine. So really good experience there. It comes with AOSP camera and not OnePlus or Gcam. So you'll have to add your own Gcam. Also the gaps are to be externally flashed and they're pretty new. So for contact syncing, you have to manually sync the contacts. So other than those things, I think the ROM is pretty nice. It's very smooth, very snappy and it's something to look forward to. I would suggest everyone to go take it for a spin. It's pretty stable. I could make calls, receive texts, install apps. There was no issues on the basic functions of the phone and there were no exceptional, you know, app forecloses that just happened for no reason. Nothing of that sort. Everything was working really well. It's a very thought about ROM and it's working very finely and especially on Android 11 that's a big feat to achieve so kudos to the developer and it's pretty bare bones to be very honest it has all the AOSP apps as stock apps so you must keep that in mind but it's snappy because it's bare bones right so I would totally suggest everyone to give it a try now uh, if you would like this video in Hindi I would request you to comment down below and <laughs> be polite if you can right and that's all for this video guys if you did like the video a subscribe share and like would be a big help to the channel 
राइट थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग द वीडियो गाइज सी यू गैन